and go. What's up guys? So we went yard selling again. I'm just making a quick, quick video just to put a little bit more content out there. And again, to prove a point. So um, today we went to two Where are you kidding? You like the hunt. I do, but I'm really tired. Like I didn't go to bed till like 3 o'clock in the morning, 2.30, 2 o'clock. And then we have to get up at 7. So I'm like, ugh, I'm tired. But you know what? We started this whole thing where we're proving a point that you can make money with yard selling. You just have to put the effort in because a lot of people say you can't. And we didn't go that long day, like two, three hours maybe. We went to a bunch of estate sales, which are tougher to make money on. Uh, and then it was two community sales, but one of them we were late. Everything was clothing, and the other one was kind of like in a senior area. So it wasn't that good. But I'm going to show you what we bought. Um, yeah, you bought some good stuff. Yeah, no. So Tatiana bought this Tory Perch, but she bought that for herself. So we actually need to put that aside. Let me put that over here really quick. So... Uh, quick pan out of all the cool stuff so we'll just kind of go through it really quick that's probably my big score today yeah so, i never even saw you get that well that was with the guy that was a big storage wars fan so he had 10 bucks oh. on this um and you guys can look it up yourself morning bright plus series the exact same helmet right now uh, he said his son is a firefighter the exact same helmet same model everything just sold on ebay for 140 bucks i didn't even negotiate with him he was asking 10 bucks now this stuff i didn't look up i just bought it just by my knowledge so not asking sold 144 there's another one on there i think the guy's asking 300 but sold 140 bucks so that's pretty good um then this was crazy beats by dr trey so this was in the senior place Guy just asked a dollar for him. He also had a bull set set, same thing, a dollar. He had both a dollar. A lady bought him right in front of us. I'm just going to throw him over for room wise. These right here, this I did look up because I wasn't familiar with that. And I know there's a lot of skates. Um, what size are they? Because they're this so... size eight. So oh, Casey I don't might think keep these them. are for sale. So this is a brand. It's called Crazy Skates. And these are the clam version. Um, Crazy Skates. So this skate company, I didn't notice. But... Go to eBay, just type in crazy skates and see, and you see a lot of these colors and stuff like this. And they go like four or five hundred bucks a skate. I think these are like 150. They have a little bit of wear. I paid, uh, actually, she gave them to us for five bucks. So, you know, I'm guessing minimum 60 bucks to 100 bucks. Um, and I also, some of the stuff, I'll probably do the little pop ups again. Wait till you see a golf club deal. That was crazy. So, I'll do a little bit of the pop ups. So, I'll put that over here. Uh, we're at the house, so we gotta take the stuff to the warehouse. Lego Star Wars, we pay 10 bucks, right? They were asking 15. I haven't looked it up yet, I'll pop it up. It's uh, it's brand new, they never build it. So we're just gonna verify. It looks like it's all in there because it's full. But we paid 10 bucks for that. I'm guessing this should bring like 30, 40 bucks. If it's retired, it'll bring more. Uh, Do the hallmark. I I'll get to the hallmark in a second. Uh, from Earth to the Moon. I gave the guy the full three bucks. I mean, it was so cheap already. These don't make you rich or anything like this. Uh, Tatiana said a sealed one just sold for 20 bucks. But, you know, if you can find, like, you know, five to ten a week, and that pays all your gas, all your food, some of your time, you make some money. These ready. I haven't looked these up yet, so look for the pop-up. I just bought them. The lady said two bucks. They're brand new sealed. They're a 3M brand, which that's a quality brand. 3M and insulate. Um, they're size 9 to 10. I paid two bucks for that. So I'm hoping that these are like 20 bucks online. If they're not, I'll give them the homeless person. So either way, we'll have got to side. Um, this Xbox deal right here. So we've got the working system. The guy said it works. It's an Xbox 360. Oh, and right here, they actually said Xbox in all games, 25 bucks. And it's crazy. This guy also had a GameCube. And somebody bought the GameCube, but they left the games. So he gave me all the games here. I mean, and they're good games too. Call of Wars. Halo, Assassin's Creed, Call of Duty, Battlefront, Gears of War 3, Halo Wars, Far Cry 3, Borderlands, Borderlands 3, okay, Bulletstorm, Red Redemption, Halo 3, Fable 3, so no sports games, so even if I did do lots of these, like six games for $29.99, I have enough for five lots, which would be $150. And you don't want okay. sports games, guys, because they go down in value because they make the new sport every year. Yeah, and then here, let's players. put these aside. Um, Lord of the Rings, Halo 4, Fable, Assassin's Creed. And I know some of these games are only five bucks, but we'll do lots. He gave me this, Jack and Dexter. He also had a PS2 somebody bought. There's a couple of Wii games, Call of Duty, Diablo. So I think I got easily a hundred bucks in games. So I think Skyrim, Assassin's Creed, Modern Warfare. It's another one, it's another one, okay. Uh, 
it's this uh, Arnarchy Edition. Rach Arnarchy Edition. Oh, it's over here. No, you didn't show that one. Yet. No, I know, yeah. Shadow of Mordor. Some kind of adventure game in Borderlands 2. So I think right here, the system. I have all the cables and stuff. Systems, controllers, all the games. With the system, it's probably, I bet you it's like 100 to 150 bucks here. But now I also got these. He said I can have these two. Xbox One. The Witcher. Shadow of War. Just Cause 3. Gears of War 4. Doom. Call of Duty Black Ops. Red Redemption 2. So what we got here? Seven games. You know what? I bet you it's 50 bucks right here. Wow. So let, let's just say everything 150 bucks. Again, doesn't make you rich, but it's pretty good, right? Then at the same yard sale, on a, at a different yard sale, we paid uh, five bucks for the two calculators, TI-83 pluses. I don't remember, I'll pop them up, but I think it should bring like 30, 40 bucks. College students always need those. Right. Those are the same ones when we first started dating. Mm -hmm. Oh, hey, how are you? You can leave them right there, I'll get them. Thank you, my friend. So, um, and then uh, TI-30X, that's probably only like 10 or 20 bucks. I'll, I'll do the pop-up. And that they're both working. We paid five bucks for both. Um, do the, the Hallmark one. The one I bought. I will. Oh, okay. Okay. So Casey bought Snoopy Snow Scene. For a dollar. For a dollar. And I can sell it for ten. Yeah, probably fifteen. Fifteen slow. I mean ten fast, but we'll just put fifteen. And then Tatiana bought this one for a dollar. She said she has the same one listed for twenty. Then we got this one right here. And so that was weird because estate sales are much, much tougher to find stuff in. Um... But this is like brand new seal in there. She yeah, said it's like the good condition. They were only asking fifteen bucks for it. Yeah. So uh, on eBay, these usually pouring. Uh, if you guarantee and everything, you should get about a hundred bucks for this. Sixty, seventy bucks if you want to sell it super fast. But we'll do a hundred. Let me put this down for a second. Then the same estate sale. I bought this flag. It's a government issue flag. Um, it's three by five, made by Storm King, made in the USA. This is for the um, Centennial. They had 25 bucks on it. I think you have it backwards, but that's yeah. fine. Everybody gets so, an idea. There you go. They had 25 bucks on it. They gave it to me for 15. Uh, one just sold on eBay for 50, and everybody else is asking like around 200 bucks for this flag. So you know what I'm saying? Minimum 50 bucks. Again, doesn't make you rich, but this is super easy, super easy to ship. And I'm buying a lot of stuff. Oh, here's another game. Another uh, Xbox One game, Call of Duty Black Ops. So, we're doing these videos just to prove a point to you guys that for the people that want to make money out there, there's plenty of money out there. You just got to go out and do it. This was one of our first finds. So, all these wood chassel tools uh, I paid 10 bucks for. Some kind of club. These are Micro Lux. I don't know, these look cheaper. So, I'm going to pop up the price for the sets. Micro Lux. Then um, gyros, I'm not familiar with those. But again, everything in this box, 10 bucks. This looks good, Speedball, made in uh, the United States. It's missing one, that's pretty old. And then here, all these are Craftsman, 22946 high-speed steel. Here, this is all made in Germany, Herzwerkzeug. What's this? Widow B. So woodworking tools, guys, especially stuff like this is pretty good. Craftsman. That's another German one. And then this said right here, carving tool set six piece. I'm not familiar with this one. Um I don't, I don't see a name on this one. So but I paid uh ten bucks for all of it. Only if you get two bucks a piece, that's sixty dollars. But I think like these sets, um I'm gonna pop up the prices, but I'm thinking you know, if I do bad, I get 60 bucks out of it. If I do really good, like 150. So that was a sale. And he saved the best for last. This was this was crazy right here. This, this was an older guy and he had signs that he wanted to be done with his sale quick. So this bag right here, and I don't even like selling it, but it was so cheap. This, everything in here is TaylorMade, okay? Right. TaylorMade R9 driver, TaylorMade iron set. So this is iron set. Um, See if it says on here. Just M70, but these are the shafts. Oh, here's still the sign. Club and bag, one dollar. <laughs> yeah, because I was confused when I saw that. So when we had the store, 
This right here be $29.99 and it would sell immediately the dealers buy it. These be $19.99 each being tailor made and these will be like 10 bucks. So each it, one. Yeah, so it still should kind of bring that on. Plus it's, the bag we would charge 20 bucks. Yeah, the bag is faded. But those are not even the good ones. So he had another box in the back of these tailor made. And same thing. He's like a dollar for the whole box. His wife was freaking out. <laughs> I'm just like, okay. He he's like, sold. All clubs, one dollar. <laughs> so in here, he has a set. I looked this up on eBay. This is a tail. It's a little bit newer tail set. There are seven. You can go on eBay. Tailor made R7. And these go on the low end for a set of five. Let's see, seven, eight, nine. So he has actually more in here. For a set of five, these go from 150 used to like four, five hundred. Probably four, five hundred is the newer ones. The arms are mad with the ear. So in here we got three, five, eight. In my store, I would put fourteen ninety nine on these because they also look good. You know, they look more modern. A dealer would come buy all these. And then uh, right here is a burner, tailor made burner. But so if I were to go to the swap meet and just sell, and dealers go run buy these. I'm pretty sure in the swap meet I could get like three hundred dollars for all these clubs. Wow! So that's another so thing. So he sent two back. That's great. Yeah. So that's an that's another thing you can do if you don't want to sell everything on eBay, just buy deals like this, and maybe once every three months go to the swap meet, and people know you just bring killer stuff that you don't want to sell on eBay. So I invested two dollars. <laughs> Let's just be conservative, okay? <laughs> Let's say I get two hundred dollars for all the tail made clubs. Is that a thousand times your money? Well, two that? times a thousand would be how much? Yeah, two thousand. So that's wrong. <laughs> well, oh. Casey works with Tatiana on all her math skills. <laughs> if you watch Store Tours, you guys have been falling out. I'm slow. I'm struggling. I'm sorry. It's two hundred times your money. Two times a hundred? Yeah. Two hundred. But I mean, I think it's an easy three hundred. I think that one eight piece set I can put on eBay and get a loan of two hundred and then sell this stuff loose. So um, again, like we didn't do that much today, but I feel like with everything. We spend uh, what's the bigger thing we bought? Twenty five. We didn't even spend a hundred bucks, and I think we have three, four fifty, five fifty, six fifty, seven fifty. Let's be conservative. We spent a hundred bucks. We got at least six hundred dollars in merchandise, and it wasn't a great day. Oh, by the way, there was another sale that was at the with the older people in that in that neighborhood, and the guy had like all these brand new macro sets, wrench sets, and things like this. And I offered him eight hundred for everything. He's like, "No, I just want three fifty for that." And he gave me another deal for four fifty, which I could have bought that. That was probably like eight nine hundred dollars worth of stuff in there. Or I could have bought everything maybe for a thousand or twelve hundred, and probably doubled my money. But it was early in the morning, and I was like, ah, "I do want to list a bunch of tools, and I'm just doing it to prove a point." And I didn't buy it. Probably in hindsight, I probably should have bought it. Maybe we should go back and buy it. But um, I just didn't feel like buying it. It would have been easy another five, six hundred dollars. So if I'm full time and that was my main gig and I'm willing to spend it, and I, you know, I got a little bit more money, that would have been easy another five, six hundred to a thousand dollars profit on that stuff. Um, I just didn't feel like dealing with it. Even this stuff, to be honest, I don't feel like dealing with it. I don't want to deal with these stupid golf clubs. But for two dollars, how can I not buy it? It's just so like, let us know in the comments, guys, if you want us to do more yard selling, if you want to see what we can buy in Southern California. Yeah, so we're just proving points. So. Um, and don't go to the estate sales. Maybe yeah, you should do a that's... video between all the different sales types, auctions, pallets, auctions, talk about it. Yeah. But again, this was kind of a crappy day. We didn't put the right effort in. We didn't do the research in advance. And just one day, you know, if we were really going hardcore, we would go into Thursday sales, Friday sales, Saturday sales, and Sunday sales. Sunday at the end, you get stuff cheap. But we're still making, what did I say, like at least 600 bucks? Yeah, crazy. So when people say you can't make any money in your business, it's just because you're not trying hard enough. And this was all low, low spending stuff this time.